Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. So, I hope you like the new setup. I'm trying something new. Believe it or not, as much as I paint, I've never actually painted on an easel. Easel? That's what it's called, right? And you know what I mean. <laughs> um, but my auntie bought this one for me as a gift, and yeah, I thought it'd be nice to use for a video. So I hope you like it, but I hope you don't like it too much because I've moved since filming this video, and unfortunately, I don't have the room or the lighting in my new house to recreate this. But so, today I'm painting this semi-portrait, I guess, because the face is covered. And I'm starting with the neck. I'm not very confident in painting necks, as you can probably tell. I accidentally um, made it look a little bit too dark. So I painted all that literally just to cover it up completely, <laughs> which you will see. There you go. Um, but you know what happens? You can't always get it right the first time and I am using acrylic so I do have the luxury of doing that thankfully <laughs> anyway so I'm gonna move on to the face I also tried a new editing style if you noticed where I'm gonna do more real-time and comment below which style you prefer the more quick time-lapse style that I normally do or this more real-time slow style <laughs> I actually kind of like this one. I think that the strokes were kind of satisfying to watch. Like this next one, wait, wait for it. It's gonna be so satisfying. Oof. Yes. <laughs> I replayed that like six times while editing this video. <laughs> it's so satisfying. Anyway, how's everyone doing? Um, I know the world is going through a lot right now and I hope everyone's safe and everyone's well. I think it's an important time for us to Make sure to support each other and comfort each other. You know, there's a lot of panic and almost hysteria going on and I appreciate you taking this time out of your day to maybe relax and enjoy this video. So I wanted to talk a little bit about where I've been and what I've been up to since I kind of want the channel to be a platform where I record my art journey in a way and share it with you guys. So I hope you guys don't mind me getting a little more chatty instead of, like, technical about my paintings. So, I always say so. <laughs> February was a busy month. I think the busiest I've ever been, ever, since I graduated at least. I work two internships, so I work six days a week, which takes up most of my time. And I'm currently applying for uni, so since I'm taking art and applying for like five different universities, I have a lot of home assignments to do. So yeah, that's actually the main reason why I've been a bit MIA, especially in the channel. Also, I decided to open my first commission for Valentine's, which I was really intimidated by and almost scared to do because, you know, I always have this thought in the back of my mind, like, oh, who would ever order this or who would ever want to buy this? But I really want to do it and I figured you know, the worst that could happen is that no one orders, which of course would be discouraging and embarrassing, but you know, I'd, I'd survive. <laughs> so yeah, nothing really came in until the last week. I suddenly had like three orders, which was great, but also meant that I was working on it day and night until like 3 a.m. most days. But yeah, I did it and I felt so great and accomplished afterwards, so... If you're kind of like a startup artist and you're thinking about opening commissions, I would really encourage you to do it and I fully support you. Ooh, also really exciting. Um, my work got published in a magazine for the first time and I totally freaked out. Um, it was a watercolor sketch sort of of a building for the company that I interned for and yeah, they were kind enough to actually publish it in a magazine and give me credit for it. If you want to see that, it's on my Instagram shameless self-promo, I know, but check it out, it would mean the world. Also, I got so many lovely requests for topics for videos to make from you guys from my Instagram, so thank you. They're great, and I'll definitely do them eventually, but it might take a while because, like I said, I've got a lot on my plate right now. So please be patient with me. So yeah, if you have any more of them, just DM me on Instagram at my career at creations or comment below. As you can see, the sun starts to set, which I actually thought was really pretty. It's actually the thing I think I miss most about my old room, is I always had this 
like the most beautiful golden hour lighting. Anyway, um, yeah, one of the questions was about opening commissions and earning money from your art. And since it was my first time, I don't think I'm experienced enough to talk about it, but I am working on more and I'm planning to start selling my art soon, so once I've gained more knowledge and confidence, I'll definitely be making a video about it and sharing my experiences and tips. Also, I hope you guys don't realize that I'm like... I also want to thank- uh, take a moment to say that we've reached 340 subscribers. What? That's <laughs> insane. I mean, considering that I only have four videos and I haven't been uploading, I think for the longest time I've had only like 50-ish subs since October. But last month it just skyrocketed and I suddenly have like 300, so thank you. Anyways, um, I'm gonna add some detail and texture to the flowers, so I'm gonna do this by adding on a really thick layer of paint. Also, you might notice the background change. I was in the process of moving when I filmed this video, so my drawer had already been moved to my new house. And yeah, we're basically almost done. I not gonna lie, I struggled a lot with taking off the tape in this one because I definitely left it in for way too long. I filmed this outro, I think like, oops, <laughs> one month after finishing the actual painting, so it literally melted onto paper. No, 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 yes, you can see. Um, yeah, I think I got it here though, right? Did I? There we go. There we go. I'm trying not to rip the whole painting. Ugh, ugh, whatever. <laughs> anyway, here's the final piece. There it is. Let's pretend that didn't happen. Um, yeah, I really love the gold. The gold really adds a flair to it, I think, especially against the sun. It looks really pretty. Anyways, thanks for watching the video. Thanks for sticking around, and please check me out on Instagram. I post a lot about my art and what I'm working on. Check my website. I do have a website, mycara.com. It's a work in progress, but it works <laughs> for now. Anyway. I'll see you soon in the next one. Hopefully. Hopefully soon. Yeah. Bye.